Hey. Before you ask, the fridge is broken. That's all right. I've had enough of your hospitality already. I have changed my ways, all right? Huh? Yeah, I'm done with that crazy shit, all right? I want to square things away with Meriwether, make sure the agency ain't coming back after us, and then do one last big score, and then you get to go back with your family. Me, I'm just going to live here. I'm going to run this, this good business showing people a good time. B bust Brad out of prison, and then, you know, happy. <laughs> so how'd you come by this place anyway? I've had it for ages. So you must know Leon, the old manager. Leon? I didn't know. Yeah, whatever, man. So what's going on here? What's going on is the big one. A long, long time ago, in a faraway place, there were three guys. Michael, Trevor, and Lester. And Brad. Uh, yeah. Sure, Brad was there sometimes as well. I mean, there were other guys, though, too. So, uh... Anyway, we uh, robbed and lied and we hurt people. Pretty much lived a low-life kind of existence. But always dreaming of one thing and one thing only. The big one. The big one. The, the big, big one. one! What is the big one? <laughs> the Union Depository. Around 200 million in gold bricks, all taken from kindly Uncle Sam, who will spend the rest of our lives being hunted by government officials if we live through the attempt. But, but it'll be my, uh, our masterpiece. So, gentlemen, let's do our civic duty and get out there and find some gainful employment. This way. Let's go. Big one. Temperature. Yeah, you know, getting a feel for it. Security, exit routes, general vibe. That doesn't look like much. Man, security looks light. We send in a couple of sprung niggas, clap, clap. What are you talking about, Frank? Oh, I see it. Man, getting in the door is easy. It's a standard bank. It's getting underground as hard. Ain't that where the metal's kept? Right. Now we gotta stop outside the Arcadia Center down on Alta Street. We can get a view of the back from there. Hey, man, you might not notice it, but I picked up a few things rolling with you. I mean, there's times I think I gotta be the senior partner in the group. From the way you and Trevor behave. Ah, oh, sorry. There's history there. Look, dawg. Light again, man. Yeah, fucking eerie, ain't it? Man, you think they put more than one motherfucker on our national fucking reserves? Yeah, huh? Well, maybe we really are broke. Trevor, how are you doing? Clockwork, Mikey. Like clockwork. You mentioned a uh, job before. Something we could help you with? I ain't even talked to Mike about it yet, but he's gonna be on board. He's obligated. What is it? Ain't it obvious? Bustin' Brad out of the clink. You need to talk to Mike about it. Oh, Fine. Shit! I was gonna pay you, man. When there ain't an obvious profit in something, you're a hard guy to motivate. Do they call it a wasting disease because you waste people's time? Move it!
so far, yeah. The, the security's internal rather than external. It's quiet enough that any disturbance is going to get picked up immediately. But what those two don't know is there's a special team of cops on standby 24-7 waiting on a signal from the UD. Won't go out on any other call. And it's never been hit. Man, those guys must get bored. They may be cops, but they work for the government. There's nothing government workers love more than to accept tax dollars for doing nothing. Oh, yeah, that and spying on innocent people. Hmm, getting paid to do nothing and spying on innocent people. Now, who does that remind me of? Anyway, if we want to hit the vault in a way that people will notice, the key will be to divert the security team. Divert it? You said they hold out for calls from the UD, and that's it. They do, so we'd have to hit it twice, once to distract them, and once to get it done. You're gonna find someone willing to get caught hitting a super bank just as a distraction? I was thinking, Michael, it might appeal to his ego. Oh, what am I saying? We got the perfect guy for it. Come in, Michael! We have a visual on the convoy! Keep with him, T. Do whatever Les needs you to do. We need to stay with him and find a place to ambush! What kind of ambush spot are we looking for? I tend to wait in the jaw and catch them with their drawers down, but I guess that won't work here. No, it, uh, won't. We're looking for somewhere with cover for us and no escape routes for them. Ah, the same principle as a men's room. Yeah, uh, I guess. <laughs> Expecting you 30 seconds ago. Tell that to the traffic. <laughs> All right. Onion 86 in the building. Now, if I remember from planning the tool store job, they're excavating the new LS Metro tunnel around here. They take us around the building and find the construction site. Roger that. Looking for a big asshole. Just hold the chopper here. You can do that, right? We need to get back. I don't have all the data I need. Hold here. Looks pretty feasible. No steel supports. It looks good. I'm lucky these projects take so long. <laughs> Just a minute. All right, I think I've got enough information to work with.
Hey, so how you feeling about this? Feeling pretty good. We got Lester planning it. He'll get us options. There's you, a guy I know I can depend on. And then there's Trevor. Ah, yeah, Trevor will get it done. And will he? I hope so, man. I hope he holds it together. Hey, you ain't done too good of a job at that yourself, you feel me? Yeah, well, I ain't pissed off hillbillies, bikers, a Mexican gang, some Chinese gangsters, and a private army, okay? So there's that. Yeah, but you just pissed off the FIB and the IAA and your family, man. You know what? I met Amanda, and I know who scares me the most. <laughs> Point taken. So you gonna tell me about this Brad Dune and the deal with the FIB? What happened in North Yankton back in the day anyway? This ain't the time. Man, we're about to go in together on the biggest job ever being pulled. There ain't ever gonna be a better time to fill me in on this shit. It's complicated, all right? Fuck it, I'ma ask Trevor. All right, holla at me. Hey, when he's got something, Lester will be in touch. Hey, man. Fuck. What do you want? I'm your friend. I don't want anything, man. Come on, your company's good enough, huh? Same as always. Yeah, thanks. I really appreciate that. So, family ain't back yet, huh? <laughs> nope. Oh, she's a goddamn fool, man. Despite all the chaos of these last few weeks, I think I finally figured it out. I know. No. Sounds ridiculous. No, actually, it does not sound ridiculous, you know? Because you, you're a killer. You know? You are a man of action. You do not sit on couches. You take scores. You're back, man. We are back. All right? All we got to go do is bust out Brad, and then we're golden, man. Franklin, he makes us multicultural. Lester makes it cyber. We're like modern America. We just get ourselves a gay friend. Bam! No, it's not it. I got money. It just makes you miserable. I want to make movies. Great. It's great. And uh, so where exactly does this leave me in the second act of your life? We're going to do this last big job. And then we're going to dissolve the partnership. This is not a game to me. All right, this is a fucking way of life. I got a fucking family. Yeah, well, I got nothing. No one gives a fuck about me. I do. Oh, fuck you. I saw your grave. I mourned you. And then it turns out that everything I fucking thought about you was wrong. Everything. You're not dead, and you're not a man. Well, what the fuck are you? I'm your fucking nightmare! Yeah, enough with your goddamn threats! I mean, let me just ask you something, all right? Something I've been, I've been thinking about. Up in North Yankton, exactly who was buried in your place? I never gave it any thought. You know what I'm thinking? I had no clue. You treacherous piece of shit! You're fucking dead! You're fucking dead! Fuck. Trevor! Hey! T! Ah, great! Hello. Yeah, can... Hey, how'd you get my number? I know where you can. Fuck you! Hey, come on, where you going? You know where I'm going, fuck you! You don't need to go all the way to North Yankton to find out what I can tell you over a couple beers back at my house. Come on, we'll order pizza. Fuck you! Fuck your pizza, fuck everything it stands for! This is insanity! Oh, no. No, it's clear and reason thought. 
Finally! Stop your car, come on! Come back, we'll talk! <sighs> I'm not gonna listen to another one of your lies! Hey, I'll lay it all out for you, everything. Just stop the car, turn around. I'm going up there to see it for myself. You'll be disappointed. <laughs> oh, I'll be something. It'll be an anti-climax. The grave's empty. Just a bag of sand, something like that. Just smoke and mirrors. Oh, the lies! How do you do it, man? The game is up! I'm trying to save you a trip. You've done me enough favors, buddy, all right? Save your fucking breath! Trevor, come on! Fuck you, Michael! Soon enough, I will. Hey, my man, where you going? Los Santos International Airport. Special yeah. Agent Norton. Shit. Davey! Shit, he knows. I think he knows. What? Who? I think! Shit. Shit, how? I don't know how. He used his head. But does he know? Does he know at all? Hey, he's on his way up to Ludendorff to confirm his suspicions. Shit. Then what? Listen, Amanda, we're going to move to Los Santos. Start over. I made a deal. The slate will be totally wiped clean. Hey, right, everybody pays attention. No one gets hurt. Trust me, darling. Look at me, Amanda. It was the only thing I could do. Either everyone dies or one guy gets out. I'm that guy. Slow and steady, team. Slow and steady. His name is Dave Norton. Nice guy. Realist. He gets the glory, I get out. It's not even a decision. Amanda, I don't have a choice. Do you want to die here where it's always snowing? Or do you want to go and live where it's always sunny? All right, you want to live? Tell me you want to live. Work this out. Some depot out of town, you don't need to know. Trust me, nothing is going to go wrong. Nothing. Yeah, I hear you. We gotta follow the plan. Everything will work out. I did the deal, Amanda. It's over. Baby, we get out. Be happy. Be normal. It ain't supposed to go down like this. We did it. Baby, we are home free. It's over. This is fucked, man. The thing is blown. Just this one job, and everything is done. Everything is done. Everything is done. Hey, you're wasting your time. Is that why you flew out here? Huh? Tell me I'm wasting my time? Go ahead, dig it up. I don't give a shit. Yeah, that's what you look like. A guy who doesn't give a shit? That's ridiculous. How long are you gonna keep lying for, Mikey, huh? When's it gonna stop? It happens in the dark. It comes out in the light. I'll give it a rest, Trevor. There's nothing there! Uh, this is it. Moment of truth. Oh. Oh. 
As if I didn't know. Brad! Look, we do what we gotta do to survive. This thing, it didn't work out the way it was supposed to. Oh, and how was that, huh? With Brad in the can and me in the ground, or, 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 or both of us in the coffin. Brad got shot. You saw it. He didn't make it. I got shot. I did. That's, that's it. I think the only thing that didn't go as planned was me showing up on your doorstep ten years later. Mikey, I mourned you. And I missed you. But I got a fucking family, Trevor. We were all gonna die. He did die. You reptilian motherfucker! I didn't want it to come to this. Yes, you did! You just don't have the fucking balls to do it! But I do! I got more to lose than you. Never a truer word has been spoken, brother. Now pull the fucking trigger! You ain't got the guts. Take the fucking shot! Who is that? Fuck! 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 Fuck. Joe Phillips! Mr. Cho has requested a word! Hey, ho, ho! I'm not the guy you're looking for! Hey, how's it been? How's it been? Get the boyfriend! Boyfriend? You motherfucker. Tis the mark! Where are you? What kind of other not yet? You are going nowhere! How many guys you send up here? Trevor, you dick! This is it for you! We could have teamed up! How many they got in this van? If you were local, you'd know the train comes by right now! <laughs> Trevor. Fuck! You got nowhere to go, boyfriend! All right, all right. Get out the fucking car. Mr. Phillips, this is Wei Chang. You know my eldest son, Tao. Yeah, the ex-nut. Backed out of a contract we agreed on. How is he? Still learning the ropes, thank you. My friends miss you in North Yankton. I was hoping we could talk. <laughs> was that your people? Ah, oh, of course. Sorry I had to cut out. Your operation causes problem for me. I want to expand into Blaine County, but your business and your temperament prevent me from making inroads. Oh, well, too bad. I don't know what you can do about that. I've already done something. We have your lover. Whoa, 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 whoa. My lover? Michael DeSanta. You live in your trailer together with the maid. And then you were alone in that big house. Well, you're clearly very close. You know, how much will you give up for his safety? <laughs> My lover. Yeah, right. It's a tough break. I never want to double-cross a friend and put him in danger, but you gotta do what you gotta do. My business ain't going anywhere. I'm serious about this. He will die. Tell him I love him dearly. Cracking. Hey, I jacked the last ride on that list. You ready to go? Shit, I'm ready to get paid, nigga. Crazy man's got the other ones. Come meet me by Glass Heroes and Strawberry so we can do the damn thing. I'm on my way. Gangsters 
move. He waiting at the garage. The boost, so homie. How did it go? Any problems? You know me, fool. Yeah, I do know you, fool. So, what you think? Smooth as silk. I'm thinking where the blood stains and the bullet holes and shit. Man, fuck. That amateur shit behind me, I'm a professional. Now, like you and them old dudes. So, line it up on the... Work, motherfuckers. Boss man's happy. Then we'll get moving. Man, this old bust ass nigga ain't no boss. Enough, nigga. Get your ass in the truck. Let's go. Sonora Freeway, past Paletto Bay. Hey, it's uh cozy in here. Scooch up, homie. Yeah, scooch over here. Scoochin' in that crazy dude? Oh, hell no, that nigga stank. Get over here. I don't bite. They ain't what I heard. All cannibalistic and shit. Frank, what you been telling him? I say what I see, homie. You dig on man meat. Ah, uh, rumor and hearsay. We got a long way to go. I get comfortable. All right, nigga, but don't try nothing. How far is it? In this thing? Yeah, about four hours. Shit. It's your operation, Slick. Shit, if you all right driving, I'm gonna catch up on some sleep. Go for it. It's all right being the boss. Meant to be running things, but this fool sleep. Yeah, I'll be asleep when your ass stop talking, nigga. Some boss. Hey, man, where that other dude? The dude that creeped on that dude. Michael, his creeping days are done. Well, what you mean? He stopped creeping? No more creeping for him. He, like, retired from, from creeping? From everything. That's funny, because, like, the boy Frank didn't mention shit about that. And as a matter of fact, I don't even know the dude. But considering the mutual acquaintances we got, I would have liked an invite to the retirement party. There weren't no party. No party? I used the term retirement euphemistically. Homie, for a dude that kills dudes and eats dudes and fuck dudes, you talk through. It's unconfirmed. What's unconfirmed? The fact that you talk stupid or the fact that you do some messed up shit? Or where the other dude's at? Like, maybe he's dead. The last one. Oh shit, man. Fuck. Do Frank know about this? I don't know if Franklin knows, but let's just let him sleep. Shit. Yeah, it's a bummer. But, you know, he wasn't the good guy he made out. Man, dude was a killer, a thief, a liar, and irritable as shit. Yeah, a liar. Above all else, a fucking liar. Homie, you sound like some bitch he ain't called. Like, oh, he lied to me. I am some bitch he didn't call for ten years. Fuck, man, he fucked you. The fucker got fucked. Damn, he fucked the fucker himself. Shut up. Man, the first time's always special. I hope he was gentle with you. Enough of that. And enough about me fucking. I don't do that. As a rule, maybe when I got to LS, I was I was a little overwhelmed by the place. I got a little out of control. But that ain't who I am, for the most part. But the Michael fucked you. Yeah, the Michael fucked me. And the Michael fucked Brad. And the Michael ran off with the FIB. Brad? Who, who the fuck is Brad? Brad is our boy back from the day. And Michael killed him? Michael got him killed. He died when Michael faked his death. I thought mm. Michael died and Brad Oh shit, what's happening? Wake up, you dozy motherfucker. One time was on a ride. This is what happens when you fall asleep on the job. What you gonna do? Okay, shit, I got an idea. Keep driving. I'm gonna take the tricked out JB700 and get rid of the tail. Devin's lawyer said there'd be some new hardware on board. Hey, don't forget the headset, homie.
You said the coast was clear when you boosted it, Lamar. It's Franklin. Franklin Clinton. Mr. Clinton, sure. For the record, this falls under attorney-client privilege. Mm, we got that shipment, you know? Cops was all over it, but we lost it. Where exactly you at? Procopio truck stop. Get here soon. We're taking a ride to the truck stop at Procopio. Procopio it is! Hey, I'm gonna speak to the legal councilwoman. Get us paid. Hello, Franklin. Yeah, where Devin at? Somewhere meditating or ripping somebody off? In light of the drama your efforts caused, we felt it was not perhaps the best idea for you two to be seen together for a while. Where's the money? Mr. Weston is one of the most brilliant investors the world has ever known. He's obviously a maverick, but he's also rigorous in his research. Yeah, he may be brilliant. Look, let me be the first to tell you. He ain't gonna fall in love with your ass. Now, where the fuck is my money? The best thing that could have happened to you in the situation has happened. He is going to hold your money, invest it in his Alpha Fund, and make the funds available to you at a time as the transfer will not induce any undue attention. Which is a polite way of saying I'm getting robbed? Are you fucking kidding me? That is a short-sighted and frankly immature way of seeing things, Mr. Clinton. Let's go. I boost car and pop motherfucker. Maturity is not really my fucking thing. Franklin. What's happening, Lester? Hey, look, you seen Michael? Man, the contact he set me up with is holding out on the payment, dawg. Huh. Uh, let's see. His phone is offline. His credit cards aren't active. This is aberrant behavior. Hmm, the last usage is for a flight to North Yankton. There, there was a signal from his cell back in Los Santos, but now nothing. Damn. Is he in the city, dawg? Shit, he could be in trouble, huh? I don't know, but it's worth speaking to Trevor. Most likely he was with him in the Midwest. I'll get him to come see you. Shit, all right, homie. Look, send him to my aunt's crib, all right? Where can I... We are women! We are free! We're bringing in to the patriarchy! We are women! Hear our pain! We are women! Hear our shout! We are women! We have no doubt! We are women! We are free! We are Shut women. the fuck up! Thank you. Oh, my N-word, huh? What <laughs> What's up, up, homie, huh? Oh. <laughs> oh. What a... Is that how you act, huh? When a, when a friend no. makes a mistake, huh? No. Uh, really? Oh, no. What? Oh, so what, it's just me getting hurt? Is that funny? No, huh? man. Well, fuck you! I'm gonna put you in the fucking ground, you laugh at me again. Man, calm down. 
I have met a lot of assholes in my life, but you? Well, you're not long for this world if this is the way you fucking act. You little jumped up, motherfucker! Look, how about this, man? Calm down. It was funny at first, man. I made a mistake. Unfortunately, man, you failed. It was funny, all right? I, I apologize. I accept your apology. Okay? All right, so... Let's hug it out. Mm-hmm. Right? Yeah, so I fucking you funny, gotcha! Huh? Oh, fuck! No, I'm not funny! Fucking asshole! Oh, fuck! I, I had a difficult childhood. Damn, man, you all right? I'm just fucking on edge, you know? Look, I love you, right? But I would have. I would have. Look, fucking! Look, man. Lester said you had some information for us about Michael. Michael? Fuck Michael! I hope he's dead. Man, I know y'all yeah. two, man. Come on, man. You two had beef before. But what the fuck happened in North Yankton? Somebody pinched him, man. Who? My friend Ron met these Chinese assholes. They're from Yangshan in China. We had some problems. They mistakenly thought Michael was a human being and kidnapped him. Yeah, and now it looks like they're holding him somewhere in the city. Yes. Come on, bro. Well, go fuck yourself. You want that piece of shit? That's your fucking business, all right? He's dead to me, all right? And chances are, if and when I see him, he's gonna be dead to everyone else as well. Hey, come on, bro. Don't do that. You're pushing your luck, pal. What was that? What? What was that? Uh, nothing. Ah! Mm, asshole! Everybody! Assholes! <sighs> hey, it's me. What did Trevor say? Man, Michael's being held by a Chinese crew. Because of Trevor. The irony isn't lost. I'm sending you an app for your phone. But Michael's cell just came back online. This will track its signal. It'll work better the closer you get. Be careful. Sure. He ain't my g -la. Don't try to persuade me, you're not lovers. He's laughing at you, you fucking idiot. You're making a mistake. It costs a lot of money to track you down. I recorded every favor uh. I could in the Midwest. And then you kill several good uh. men. Good day, huh? Good day. Good fucking day to you! Kill him. Hey, Trevor hey. Phillips no. isn't coming. Whoa, 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 No, hey, hey, hey! Hey, I'm a valuable commodity! <clears throat> Jim! Now you strapped, man! You was right! What about more coming? They got you locked down hard, homie! Hey, look out! The dude's coming from the left! More of these dudes! Yeah, it turns out they really want Trevor dead! Go figure! Shit! Hang in there, dog! I'm, I'm gonna check around the corner! Can you get yourself down? Oh, uh, I was just beginning to... 
spiel it all. Damn, how many of these fuckers are there? You want to get out of here? Shit! Get up, let's go! We going out this way! Follow me, man! Hey, yo, beep with Trevor... Philip! Stupid sons of bitches! That's it, man! Let's go! This way! We almost out! Come on! Come on! Let's go! This is my rescue mission, dog. We're going! I just want to get home! I'm gonna get you here! Fuck, they're coming after us. I'll lose them, okay? How do you like me with a gun in my hand? Be careful. Hey, let's see if they can keep up. See ya. Show. Sure. Hey, sure you don't want to come in? What, your big empty ass house? Dog, I'm depressed enough already. All right. Well, listen, thanks. Look, man, before you go, what the fuck happened up there? I said, Trevor went crazy, tried to kill me, I got jumped by the Chinese. Man, before all that, I'm talking about the fig. Trevor, this guy Brad, man. I know what you meant. I made a judgment call. I don't know if it was the right one. I did what I thought I had to do. I had a young family, Franklin. I was running with a crew of crazy motherfuckers with nothing to lose. I saw it out. A future for me, for my family. I took it. You took it? Man, you burned every motherfucker you've ever known. It was that or die. <clears throat> Look, I know it sounds cold. I don't expect you to understand it. Not yet, but you will. When you got ties of your own. Look, you wake up one day, and, and your legs, they just give. You just can't run anymore. All right, man, look. You watch your back, all right? When Trevor finds out you're still alive, I don't know what the fuck he gonna do. Don't worry about Trevor. He's not gonna get near me. Hey, you watch your back. You hear me? Dog, it ain't me he coming for. We straight. It's you, dog. It's you. Say. 